U.S.-Armenia Trade and Investment Framework Agreement is a basic document between Armenia and the U.S. through which trade and investment council or business councils are established. This is a tool for discussing all necessary issues between two countries regarding trade and investment. Of course, we have the bilateral format of cooperation. This is the U.S.-Armenia Task Force. But the agenda of this uh, task force is too broad and we can't uh, address all issues during this uh, meeting, USATF meeting. And that's the reason we want to separate trade-related issues and to sign the TIFA agreement, mm -hmm. establish uh, this Trade and Investment Council. The main goal of TIFA is to reduce non-tariff technical barriers to promote investment between two countries, to help new business communities representing new firms in both countries to protect their rights. Under the U.S. ATF, we established a few work groups. The first working groups, the, it is the trade-related issues working groups. And the main topic of this working group is the starting the negotiation and prepare all necessary documents for starting negotiation for signing the TIFA agreement. Mm -hmm. The Armenian side has prepared the first draft of the U.S.-Armenia Trade and Investment Framework Agreement. The two parties will discuss it during the upcoming ATF meeting. After establishing Trade and Investment Council in the framework of TIFA, the Armenian government will start to work on a new, more specifically targeted agreement, for example, a new double taxation treaty. This is also very important for us, and uh, like at TIFA, we are... Uh, raising this issue on signing the new double taxation agreement between Armenia and U.S. in each uh, USATF meeting. Having preferential trade regime with the U.S. for Armenia, the United States is one of the important trade partners. The U.S. for us is, uh, let's say, uh, one of the important trade partners. And we have the GSP regime, the uh, goods originated in Armenia, we can import to the U.S. market with preferential trade tariffs. And this is the unique opportunity for us to uh, <coughs> help our domestic production and increase the industrialization in our country. Also through the U.S., Armenia can involve and invite many transnational companies to come to the country and do some private investments. Congressman Rodney Frelin Heisen, in a letter to the U.S. Trade Representative Ambassador Ron Kirk, stated that working toward a TIFA between the U.S. and Armenia would be an important step in securing long-term economic ties and furthering the trade relations of both countries. We want to thank Congressman Frelin Heisen for his leadership in seeking to bring the benefits of trade to both the United States and America, said ANCA New Jersey spokesperson James Sagan. In September of this year, Congressman Robert Andrews also called upon Ambassador Kirk to negotiate a U.S. Armenia TIFA. In his letter, Representative Andrews noted that this agreement would build upon American current economic dialogue with Armenia and establish a broader reach than the U.S. Armenia Joint Economic Task Force. Kaya Media, Armenia.